we now study performance analysis time complexity time complexity of an algorithm is the amount of cpu time that it needs to run a particular program time complexity is also required to run a program p which also consists of two components the first one is the fixed part now what do you mean by the fixed part of the time complexity component the fixed part of the time complexity component is the time which is independent of the problem instance that is which is a constant part and the second one is the variable part that is the run time which depends on the problem instance that is tp so the time complexity tp is equal to the constant part that is the fixed variable plus the variable part now time complexity is also divided into three types the first one is the best case time complexity what is a best case time complexity efficiency of an algorithm for an input of size n for which the algorithm takes the smallest amount of time that is the best case time complexity the average case time complexity is defined as if the given expected value of tn that is average case is used when the worst case and the best case does not give any necessary information about the algorithm behavior then the algorithm efficiency is calculated on the random input the third one is the worst case time complexity what do you mean by the worst case time complexity it is the efficiency of the algorithm for an input of size n for which the algorithm takes the longest amount of time time complexity is calculated on the basis of the first one is operation count that is the number of operations it has find the basic operation such as a is equal to a into b this code takes one unit of time the second one is the step count now the step count let's take an example as shown x is equal to a plus b takes a step count of 1 when we take a for loop variable or a for loop for instance it changes from 1 to n then the step count is n for the third one that we are seeing it is for i is equal to 1 to n and for j is equal to 1 to n the step count is n square for the second example let's take a look a small algorithm is given over here where it calculates the sum of the array if we see the first one is a function definition so the execution and the frequency and the total amount of time complexity is zero the second one is a opening brace so for the same the step count and the frequency and the total amount of time complexity is zero for the two for loops for i is equal to 1 to n the frequency is n plus 1 so the total time complexity is n plus 1 for j is equal to 1 to m the time complexity and the frequency is n multiplied by m plus 1 the assignment statement s is equal to s plus a of ij is executed n into m number of times and return us s and return s takes a frequency of 1 and time complexity of 1 if we add up all together the time complexity for this code is 2nm plus 2n plus 2 thank you